Dear viewers, greetings. In this video, we are going to see about the gram-negative cocci, Neisseria meningitis. Uh, first, general characteristics of Neisseria meningitis. Uh, Neisseria meningitis is a gram-negative spherical shaped cocci and its arrangement is uh, diplococcine arrangement and it is non-motile in nature and its size is ranging from 0.6 to 1 micrometer in diameter. It belongs to the family Neisseriaceae and capsules are occasionally present and endospores are absent. Uh, regarding the respiration, aerobic mode of respiration is observed in Neisseria meningitis and the optimum temperature for the cultivation of Neisseria meningitis is 35 degrees Celsius to 37 degrees Celsius and the optimum pH is 7 to 7.5. Uh, the Neisseria meningitis is categorized into various zero groups. They are uh, zero groups A, B, C, H, Y, and W135. And the habitat of the Nigeria meningitis is, uh, it is a normal human flora of uh, Nasopharynx region. And it was discovered by the scientist, the uh, Australian bacteriologist Anton Weishalbum in the year 1887 from analyzing from the cerebrospinal fluid or CSF of the patients uh, who was infected with the meningitis. And disease transmission. Uh, Neisseria meningitis infection are mainly transmitted by inhaling the infected droplets uh, which was uh, dispersed by sneezing or coughing. And some of the virulence factors responsible for causing the Neisseria meningitis infections are capsular polysaccharides, IgA protease, plasmids, fimbria and pili, lipooligosaccharides, pore A and pore B proteins, OPA and OPC proteins and finally iron binding or acquisition proteins. The incubation period for Neisseria meningitis infection is uh, 3 to 4 days and the infective dose required for uh, causing infection is 3 lakhs organisms in humans. Uh, next pathogenesis of Neisseria meningitis. Uh, Neisseria meningitis uh, first takes residence on the mucosal membrane surface as in the nose, throat and respiratory tract by attaching with its pili. Uh, it, it then gradually infects uh, deeper into the tissues until it gains access to the bloodstream uh, where it then travels to infect the meninges of the brain. Uh, Neisseria meningitis produces an antiphagocytic capsule polysaccharide, uh, a coat that contains a high variable surface proteins. And finally, uh, Neisseria meningitis uh, produce large amount of endotoxins and lipopolysaccharides during the exponential growth phase and naturally people with the weakened immune system or immunosuppressed or at great mortality risk which is uh, why most victims are children. Uh, clinical diseases of Neisseria meningitis. Neisseria meningitis results in three clinical diseases. They are meningitis, meningococcemia and pneumonia. Uh, the first clinical disease caused by the Neisseria meningitis is uh, meningitis. Meningitis is a purulent inflammation of meninges which is associated with uh, headache, meningeal signs and fever. And in this case, high mortality rate was observed unless promptly treated with an effective antibiotics. The second clinical disease caused by the Neisseria meningitis is meningococcemia. Uh, meningococcemia is a disseminated septicemia uh, characterized by thrombosis of small blood vessels and multi-organ involvement. Uh, thrombosis means the formation of a blood clot inside the blood vessels and the meningococcemia uh, results in small uh, petrical uh, skin lesions uh, which or extended into large hemorrhagic lesions. And next to the third clinical condition caused by the uh, Neisseria meningitis is pneumonia. And pneumonia is a milder form of meningococcal disease uh, which is characterized by bronchopneumonia in patients with underlying pulmonary diseases. And next laboratory diagnosis of uh, Neisseria meningitis. The first diagnostic method is uh, microscopic examination. Uh, under gram staining, Neisseria meningitis was observed as uh, pink colored gram negative cocci arranged in form of coffee bean shaped diplococci. 
and regarding the motility it is non motile in nature a next call in morphology in culture medium in blood agar rhizera meningitis shows gray circular colonies with uh, gamma hemolysis uh, in mckonkey agar white colored non lactose fermenting colonies were observed and there are two selective medium for rhizera meningitis they are thayer martin medium and new york city medium in thayer martin medium uh, the colony morphology of uh, rhizera meningitis was medium to large blue to gray smooth moist mucoid glistering circular or round transparent colonies uh, in the thayer martin medium uh, thayer and martin used a uh, vancomycin uh, colistin and uh, nistacin and martin and lester used an additional antibiotic trimethoprim to make the medium selective uh, in new york city medium Neisseria meningitis shows medium to large, blue to grey, smooth, moist, mucoid, glistering, circular or round transparent colonies. A biochemical test, a catalyst test positive, oxidase test positive, urea test negative, indole test negative, methyl red test or MR test negative, Vogus Prescott test negative, citrate utilization test negative, starch hydrolysis negative casein hydrolysis negative glucose fermentation and maltose fermentation positive finally uh, treatment and prevention of nigeria meningitis infection uh, breastfeeding infants have passive immunity for first 6 months uh, treatment with septo uh, cefotaxim or ceftriaxone should be initiated if the ice rate is penicillin susceptible a uh, treatment can be changed to penicillin c uh, chemo prophylaxis for contact with persons uh, with the disease is with uh, rifampin ciprofloxacin and ceftriaxone uh, for immuno prophylaxis uh, vaccination is an adjacent to chemo prophylaxis and it is used only for the zero groups a c x y and w135 uh, no effective vaccine is available for the zero group b Dear viewers that's all about the nigeria meningitis thank you for your support thank you